Well, thanks for streaming with us tonight at 10 o'clock. I'm Allison Montoya. Tonight we have new information for you after a 24 year old Brown County man is charged with murder. He's accused of shooting and killing his grandfather and seriously hurting his grandmother and cousin. And now we have the 911 calls from that shooting. Our Peyton Marshall is going to break those calls down for us, but we want to warn you tonight. These calls are disturbing. Nephew just shot everybody next to it. shot my mom and dad and my son. What's the address? 5612 Wallsburg East Road. Is everybody breathing? Do you know where they are? My oldest son, my oldest son's got blood all over him. He ran over here to me and told me my dad yeah, he shot my dad in the head, and I don't know what happened to my mom. He throwed all their phones. I kept her. I thought I heard a gunshot, and I get one out, and I seen him throwing phones out in the yard. This is the disturbing 911 call made by Ralph Neff Jr. on Wednesday after a horrific shooting involving his family. We now know Ralph Ref Jr. is the suspect's uncle. 24-year-old Noah Clifton is accused of a triple shooting that killed his grandfather, Ralph Neff Sr., and critically injured his grandmother, Margaret Neff, and his cousin, Zachary Neff, who you hear on the phone with dispatch. Somebody, uh, my cousin shot me and my grandparents. Okay, all right. I'm, Let shot, me... I'm shot in the face. My grandma's off the ground. I don't know if she's responsive or not. All right, sir. All right. I right. We're going to get some help your way, okay? Where... Who is it that did uh, he, this? He is our, he's my cousin, but he's schizophrenic, and I don't know where he got a gun. He's still at the address with uh, with his weapon. It's a handgun. Okay, what's the nephew's name? Noah Clifton. Say the first name again. Noah Clifton. I, I'm shot in the face. It's hard to speak. According to court records, Clifton fantasized about killing his grandparents for several weeks while playing Xbox. All right, sir, we're going to get some help your way, okay? Do you know where he went? Uh, he's sitting outside. He has my, my phone, my grandparents' phone, and I don't know if anybody's killed, dead. All I know is I sprinted next door and grabbed the phone. We're going we're gonna to need at least three ambulances, too. I I understand, sir. We're getting help okay. your way. Uh, uh, I, I, I know you're doing what you can. I'm just, I've never had anything like this, and I'm just, my head's pounding, my heart's pounding. I'm shot in the face. It's just, I understand. It, I lost where? a lot of blood to him. Clifton's bond was set at $1 million during his arraignment, where he appeared by video conference. Brown County Prosecutor Zach Corbin says since his arrest, Clifton has been combative and acting erratic. Can you tell me what he's wearing? He is wearing a, uh, a blue T-shirt, white shorts. He's sitting on the trunk of his car, like, just smiling. My dad is a next door neighbor, which is where I'm at. He has his handgun for if he tries to come over here and attack us. As our patient Peyton Marshall reporting now, according to court documents, Noah Clifton denied shooting anyone. He did admit to recently buying ammunition in two magazines. The documents also show that when Clifton went into the home of his grandmother and she asked him why his response to her was, quote, because I can. Noah Clifton is being held at the Brown County Detention Center. This is still an ongoing investigation.